And let's begin with a news break coming in on another massive diplomatic win for India. And what no doubt comes as a huge boost to Indo US ties. The United States has waived the sanctions act on India, which was imposed over the S 400 deal with Russia. India has won and a Trump era threat has been given a burial. This is a huge vindication for India's defense autonomy. Essentially, the countering American adversaries uh, through Sanctions Act has been essentially waived for India. Remember that this sanction was in fact imposed on India for the S-400 deal with Russia. But it looks like constant dialogue, diplomacy has worked in India's favor. Now, with the United States taking that big step, of waiving the act on India. Let's take this across to Gaurav Savant and Geeta Mohan who are joining us on the broadcast. Gaurav, I'd like to begin with you. Good morning. The United States is referred to this perhaps as the biggest step in Indo-US ties since the nuclear deal and that's exactly what this development is. You know, this is monumental. This is huge um, uh, when it comes not just to India-US relations but also India and U.S. effectively countering China's aggression uh, in this entire region. This is landmark. India, of course, had been advocating uh, for CATSA, saying India's acquisition uh, of the S-400 system predates CATSA and India will go ahead uh, with the missile defense system, which is very crucial uh, along the line of actual control for India's defense against China. The fact that there is bipartisan support to this in the United States of America is extremely significant and will go a long way in two ways. One, it strengthens India-U.S. relations because U.S. appreciates India's concerns and India's very strong stance. India needs the United States. United States needs India. Democracies need each other to counter an expansionist China. That message goes across. The U.S. wants to wean India away from Russian military hardware but that will not happen overnight given the strategic ties between India and Russia that go back almost uh, uh, more than half a century. So America also realizes that and there is bipartisan support of, uh, towards that. And okay. this Katsa waiver goes a long way in strengthening Indo-US ties and India's military modernization both going hand in hand, Akshita. Very true and this is very clearly a message being sent across to China as well. Let me bring in Geeta Mohan, a foreign affairs editor also on this broadcast. Geeta, who would have thought, you know, there were so many naysayers just months ago saying that Indo-US ties have hit rock bottom. This is clear proof, clear indication that our diplomatic ties with the United States is at a new high. Geeta, can you hear me? Apologies, looks like Geeta is not with us. Uh, but this is the big, big breaking story uh, that we have for you here on India Today. The United States taking that big step of waving the cats are countering American adversaries through Sanctions Act on India. Remember that these sanctions were imposed over India's S-400 defense deal with Russia. But now in that big, big monumental step, it's been waived.